Hello everyone. In this video, we will cover how to install the Prusa Slicer software to be used with the Prusa 3D printers. Ensure you have downloaded the latest version from Prusa's website and transferred it to your desktop. Once downloaded, run the installation file. The software would check for any latest available version, then the welcome screen would appear. Your version may be newer than the version shown in this video. Go ahead to click Next. In this page you can install the software to a specific Windows account or to all users. Select the account or select everybody, then click Next. Select the location where the software will be installed. It would be best to install in C drive, inside the Program Files folder, for ease of troubleshooting. Click Next. Select the necessary features only. You will need to select Prusa Slicer software and common files, which are required for this installation. Deselect all other options as you will not need them. Utilities are not used in this module. Sample objects will not be used as you'll be creating your own files. Drivers will not be used as SP staff will update the printer firmware when necessary. Double check that the necessary features are selected. Click Next. These selections are to create the Prusa Slicer program shortcuts. It is recommended to create shortcuts in Desktop and Start menu. Then click Install. Depending on your Windows security setting, you may get a user account control pop up to confirm the software installation. Click Yes. Now the installation will begin. Wait for a few moments. Once the installation is complete, you'll notice there's a shortcut on the desktop. Go ahead to click Finish. Check with your lecturer if you have any errors during installation. Any errors may cause the software to run incorrectly.